I grew up in South London. My grandparents were ministers, so we would have church pretty much seven days a week. I mean, I had choir practice, Bible study, prayer meetings. It was always vibrant and there was music and prayer and everything going on at the same time. So when I was about eight years old, my grandmother saw me singing. My grandmother started getting excited saying, Michelle has the most incredible voice, we have to listen to her. And then she said, could you sing this Sunday? We have some people coming over as guests. So I learned a Hawking song, which was called God Will Open Doors For You. I'm, I'm eight years old singing in front of about 100 people at my grandparents' church. And I realized, like a kid with a new trick, that every time I hold the notes really long, everybody starts getting excited. <laughs> so I'm really holding the notes long, and then suddenly my grandmother and my grandfather are taking me all around the UK, and I'm singing at every single church in the UK. And then fast forward, I was discovered singing in Lee Church, got signed up to Island Records. While my grandparents were alive, this was always their dream that I would make a gospel album and here I was just making pop albums you know because I've been running from the church my whole life I think. basically I wanted to go back and so for me it, it's a very emotional moment for me making this album because I know that they're up there looking down very happy that I finally did it there are two new compositions on this album the rest are all covers but they're not just covers we sat down and talked about my favorite songs over the years that are not necessarily my songs, just songs that have just inspired me. And I've always wondered, gosh, I'd like to sing that song because it means so much to me. But Labby Sifri, Something Inside So Strong, Sam Cooke, A Change Is Gonna Come. Right now, these songs have been given new life on this album, I think, because of the time that we're in. Because I think right now we need faith. We need to believe that we're gonna get through this terrible time. I think I've picked the best of the greatest songs ever written. I really do.